sounded like a decent ball. He just crept into there and then next minute started. Yes, 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 good! Boys just jumped off as we're heading to the creek and I'm. Hey, stay in there. Get him, here. Good boy, boy. Get him, get him, boy. Get him. There's the ball there. And then, um, some lots down there. Let's camp. Yeah, he was on a bit of a Did run. you see him, did you? He was out. He was good at it. He'll take yeah. some stuff and know he was on the motor. Yeah. 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 Get off of me. Good boy. Welcome back to World's Adventures. We're just out for a few days this weekend. It's actually Blake's Bucks party, so it's probably one of his last trips. He's getting married. And uh, <laughs> and he's brought his uh, future father-in-law along, Michael. Got his good mate Frankie along. The old boy, Josh. And uh, young Jack, he's, we've managed to get him out again. So Yeah, we stole him. Yeah, we stole him. <laughs> yeah, she still doesn't even know he's missing yet. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> we're out here now, so. <laughs> but uh, we're going to head off now for a while. Just taking Huey. We've got Big Master, Buff, and the young Chief, wherever he is. And oh, he's in there ready to go. Look, should have known. Bit of a tree across the road here. Gonna get the little chainsaw. Put your foot down, we'll see how that goes. Little chainsaw, you know how to use that, mate? Not really. So we're out of charge here. Luke's bringing the buggy down. Gonna use his battery. <laughs> Take the bolts out and try and use his battery to start the buggy. So we've taken the battery out of the boy's old Tatsu. Uh, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Nothing. I actually reckon you've done this before, old fella. Hit her. Hit her. See what happens. Hey! Hey! Tiny bit of wire, it's a bit warm. And a big bit of wire. Straight from the battery. Straight to that battery, how good's that? New, new type of jump loop. Hey, that's, <laughs> that's up every day. I wouldn't advise that, and everyone at home, do not do that. But yeah. it worked. If you do really get stuck, and you've got to walk home like these ones. It sounded like a decent ball. He just crept into there, and the next minute it started. Yes, yes, good boy, master. Yes. <laughs> yes. Good dog. Good boy, master. Good boy. Here's a little sow here. Master um, ended up coming up with it. The dogs jumped on top of this ridge here, and the old dogs went the left side of the road, and master just wandered down here and followed his nose and ended up catching this little sow. It's a um, pretty good effort. And we've got the whole crew here, so first pig for the night. Hopefully a few more to come. Let's keep going. We're going to keep heading now and um, do a bit more open country down the bottom and hopefully hopefully come up with some more. Back up here I think. We just jumped off as we're heading to the creek. And... Good pig. Good dogs. Oh, good pig. Good dogs, eh? Here's this ball we just got. Um, we're just heading down the road and the dogs jumped off a couple of times and um, they couldn't quite get it. The wind's not really feeding them the best tonight, but um, we drove another probably 100 metres, 150 metres down the road and they've tailed back up the road from where we come from and hit this good ball just over in the grass there. And um, It's a good size ball, he's bloody 65 kilos around that. Dog's done really well, good team effort. and. Um, yeah, we're just heading back to camp and we end up getting him, so pretty good start for the weekend. A sow and a good sized boar, so hopefully tomorrow brings a few more. Hey, he's staying there. Get him, here. Good boy, boy. Get him, get him, boy. Get him, boy. Get him. Good dog. Good dog. Good boy, boy. Good boy. What a cranky bastard. Here's the boar. We're just heading back to camp. We went and got Chiefy. And I picked him up and started heading back and ball come off the old green feed there 
and started jogging up the road and he turned and wanted to fight the buggy and Huey, had, Huey um, hit him to start with. He threw Huey off and then um, went through the fence and waited for the dogs to get them the other side and um, yeah, big buff got hold of him as you see in there and started driving the pair of them up underneath the log then but he was, uh, yeah, he thought he was going to beat them but we, uh, we got him so. There's the ball there and then uh, them lights down there, that's camp. So, not real far at all. Just gonna head back out again now, just finished breakfast. We didn't get, um, well we headed back after that one ball, or that last ball we got just up the road here last night. But um, the dog's done well. This morning we're gonna take Macro, Rog, Young Chiefy and Master. So we're gonna swap the team over a little bit, uh, give Huey and um, Buff a rest for, the, for mm -hmm. today, and we'll take them back out the Savo tonight. <laughs> Yeah, he did. He was on a bit of did a you run. see him, did you? Run, that fella. Rod got onto him quick and cut straight down there. How many did you see? I seen one. Yeah. Is that all it was? Yeah, that's all I seen. Yeah. One pig. Yeah, one ball. He was about, he would have been. He'll take some stopping though. He was on the motor head. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Rod's have to roll to the bottom to catch him. No, I reckon you'll, Rod will get him, but he'll be over at that next ridge, I reckon. If you need it. He'll get it. Listen, if I, if I go down there 250, you'll get West back to get there. <laughs> <laughs> Here, Because it's going to be down in that gully. Yeah, you drive down, we'll meet you down there. You got the camera, Jack? Sounds alright. Yeah, don't it. Get off him, boys, get off him. Good boys. Good boys. He's got himself. Get him, get him. Hey, he's in a good. Good dogs. Alright. We're just down here in the cave here. Where the dogs end up pulling him up. I'll jump down in there. Just jam, just sitting up in here. And there's absolutely, you know, the dogs had no chance. He didn't even, he wasn't even screaming in the end. He just thought he had a beat. We got him. Awesome work. I'm gonna do a quick video and get these dogs back to some water. He come across the road and the dog sort of smelled him uh, before we seen him and took off straight down the gorge the way he run and he had a massive start and we weren't, weren't expecting to get him and we are just waiting up the top there having a chat and sure enough they uh, they got him and he let out a few screams to start with but he must have kept running down this cliff here and got himself in this cave as you've seen and then once he got in there there was no scream and he just he thought he had him beat and uh, as you've seen on camera there Blake had to come down over the rocks here and get behind him. Yeah no when we, when we got him he, he was uh just backing himself up in that um, little cave there, like Luke said, and the dogs were working on him, and um, he was he was giving up a fight all the way until we um, got rid of him. But yeah, it was a bloody good team effort from the dogs, and hopefully we can get a couple more around, some more uh, water holes and that as the day goes on. So we'll keep going. Keep going, get these dogs some water, and um, yeah, ask some water. So let's go, and Westpac for John. <laughs> <laughs> the fun begins. Getting out of here. <laughs> nah, just got back. Just got back to camp then. Cook a feed and relax for a bit. And then we'll head out a bit later. As it gets, as it starts to get dark again. Just calling the dogs up and getting ready to head out again for our Arvo hunt. 
and uh, the boys have spotted some pigs the home point has been updated. just sitting out Let's here so I'm just going to um, put the drone up and follow the boys and hope that they come up with some fingers crossed Yeah, it sounds like a pretty decent pig. I'll just put the drone down. <laughs> you might be able to hear it on camera, but Blake's got one, so dogs must have kept going and catching back, caught back up with them pigs or something. Anyway, that's bloody good. We'll go and check it out. Get him, boys. Get him, master. Get him, boys. Master, get him. Here's this, um, black and white boar that Rog just got on his own. Um, we spotted the pigs on the green feed. Rog went on another, um, the other dogs too, uh, the other dogs peeled out and um, Rog kept going right up the top here, probably from where we started. It'd be easier kilometer um, or probably more. And um, he pulled this one up, it took him a bit to get, but it was an unreal job from Rog. He's just absolutely surprised us with this one. and. Um, yeah, it was, it was bloody good, so we are uh, going to get him to water now and um, give him a bit of a break and we're just walking back out um, from that ball Rog just got and uh, me and Jack ran all that way while the others pulled out, so um, it was a bloody good effort from him and um, we got ahead, like I said, it'd be easy a kilometre. It was a bit of a good sized pig for, for the effort he put in, he put in massive efforts. <laughs> Yeah, if you're close by, pick us up. We're on the other side of the track. We're not even at the um, track yet. Um, yeah, so the boys are just coming now um, and they're going to pick us up on the buggy and um, get Rog and Master to water. We're just uh, picking up the boys now. They've just come back with Rog. Um, they end up getting, I'm not sure how big it is or anything yet. So by this point, you'd probably know more than me. <laughs> we'll, we'll, uh, we'll see how they went. Yeah, you get one? Good one? Oh, 50. 40, 50. Any tasks or anything? No. Nah. Nah. Unreal. Yeah. Oh, Unreal fine, yeah. Awesome fine. Awesome. He's on his game, but he just needs a bit of a good. Good boy, get him! Get him, mate, get him! Good boy, get him, get him! Get him, boy, get him! Good boy, master! Good boy, get him! Get him, mate, get him! Good boy! Get him. So we're just uh, heading back to camp to have some dinner. We, um... Picked up the boys there before, just before dark, and Rog and done a bit of a loop. And we're heading back to camp here, and Rog and Macro jumped off the buggy and started going through the grass pretty hard. And um, Master was on Blake's buggy, and the boys flushed a pig out and started running back towards Blake's buggy. So Big Master jumped off and got this little boy. He's probably about 35 kilo, something like that. But um, yeah, it's good. Been a good arvo so far. We're gonna head back to camp now, have some dinner, and. Um, Keep going. All right, we just uh, finished off dinner. We're gonna head back out. We'll swap the swap Rog and Macro out for Buff and Huey tonight. Also, Big Master will stay behind and rest up, and we'll get Big Mighty out, Master's brother. So, um, yeah, there's a bit getting about. So, hopefully, last night we get a get a couple. Mm, no, nah, serious, it was on the road here, Buff hit it here and it flicked him. Well, it looked like a sow, but then I'm pretty sure I smelt ball. <laughs> Regain this pig by the sounds of it. Yeah, they got it, it's not screaming. Good dogs! Good 
Good dogs, get on. It's a sear. It's a sear? Yeah. Good dogs. Good dogs. Good dogs. Good dogs. Here's a sow that um, just crossed in front of the boys um, as they were coming down. Uh, Buff hit it just on the road, it flicked him and then headed straight down into the scrub. Um, it'd be a few hundred metres down in here and pretty thick. It was really good work from um, Huey and Buff to regather her and um, she'd be about 60 kilos or more. Um, pretty heavy in pig by the looks of it, so it's um, a good job getting getting rid of her for the farmers and that. So we are uh, got a bit of a track back to camp and it's um, pretty late, so hopefully we can get a couple more. Or... We're back at the buggy now, so we'll, we'll keep on heading. We're just about to uh, open this gate here and heap of pigs with just sitting in this corner of this paddock. We got a little boar there. <coughs> that was a whole mob sitting in this corner here. <laughs> and I've, I've, by the time I seen them, like they didn't start running until, until we got right here, so. Oh, yeah, it was a bit slow on the camera, but anyway, that's another another ball down. Awesome. Keep heading heading on back to camp. Pig's just trying to cross the road, and we bloody good boy ball, good boy, good boy ball. Well, I thought he had it right there. Good boy, Huey. So he's a uh, another two little balls. We just left that one that we got back there at the gate and uh, drove up the track a bit and there was a whole mob that ran across in front of us and Huey and Buff split. Buff got the first one on the road here and then yeah, Huey got that one over the hill there. So, uh, real good night. We'll just uh, keep making our way back and hopefully run across a few more. Well, it only means one thing, packing up here. Heading home, Jack's doing the uh, wash it up, doing the dishes. Done that a fair bit, haven't you, Jack? Yeah, I'll do it a bit, mate. When's the next hunt you're on? When we expect you, October. Mid October. <laughs> Mid October next year. Yeah. Well, we got uh, five pigs, I think, last night was the, was the total. So it was uh, a really, really good night. That was just the night, and the Arvo, the boys got a couple more. So, yeah, it's been a bloody good weekend. I think it was about 11 all up, and. Uh, yeah, proud of the dogs this weekend. They, they done me proud, so it was really good. It was um, it was last few weekends been pretty quiet, so it's good to get a few more. But um, pack up now, finish loading the rest of the gear, and we'll uh, get on the road. Thanks for watching. If you like what we do here at Wells Adventures, please like and subscribe. It helps the channel out a lot, and it's free. Hey. <laughs> uh, anyway, I asked Dad if I could drive, and he sort of, he didn't take it real well. <laughs> so he's picked all his gear up and he's gone over to Blake. So he's better buggy anyway. So anyway, we'll uh, we'll get going now. You, you type of jump loop. Hey. <laughs> that's, that's every day. I wouldn't advise that. Everyone at home, do not do that. But yeah. it worked. If you do really get stuck, because you've got to walk home like these lot. <laughs> So if, if you do get stuck, do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Don't do it at home, but if you get stuck, do it. <laughs> no, I reckon you'll, Rog will get him, but it'll be over that next ridge, I reckon. Keen when they jump, yeah, we didn't. Now, mate. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs>